Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Dr. Sumit Mrek. I am a principal consultant and head of ENT at Max Smart Super Specialty Hospital, Saket. I am also the director for the cochlear implant program and I have successfully operated more than 400 cochlear implant surgeries in children and adults. Today, on the eve of uh, World Hearing Day, I would like to tell my friends and everyone that in the world, hearing loss is progressing every day. In India, about 100,000 children are born deaf and so many more become deaf because of so many infections in the world. What I can tell you is that with, with newborn hearing screening program now getting it centralized in the country, every child can be diagnosed with hearing loss at birth. Also, this is uh, if they are found to be profound deaf, we have a solution what we call as a cochlear implant surgery. Cochlear implant surgery is a device through which a child can get his hearing back and can again start speaking. With a cochlear implant surgery and a post-operative AVT therapy, these children can, can go into mainstream education with the help of AVT therapy. The important thing is that the surgery should be done uh, as young as 11 months of age and with, with early surgery and early rehabilitation, these children get back to normal. Cochlear implant surgery is also a boon to so many adult population and old age population who cannot hear with the help of hearing aids. In them also, they can get their hearing back with the cochlear implant surgeries. Our aim on this World Hearing Day is to make sure that everyone should look after their hearing and not just ignore it. Please meet your ENT surgeon, get your hearing test done and find out a solution, whether it is uh, ear cleaning or if you have a perforation you, you can get the surgery done or use of a hearing aid and in the worst case scenario if your hearing is completely down more than 90 percent then cochlear implant surgery is a solution thank you subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest healthcare updates